I had taken my dad to the doctor for the flu and the doctor was not my doctor. He wasn't my normal doctor, but my mother was on oxygen and we had decided like if we could pre-treat anybody else. So he said, let me check you real quick. Um, and I believe he saved my life because when he looked in my throat, he jumped back and said, wow, your tonsil is huge. They said it was the size of a, uh, like a, a large walnut and it went down my throat. So I couldn't see it all. Um, but I believe that at that point I was scared. And, you know, at the time I thought, oh, well, it's probably just swollen. It's got infection in it. But uh, it was a couple of days before Christmas when the doctor called and said, well, it's lymph I'm here with me and my husband were out Christmas shopping and she said, well, it's lymphoma, it's cancer. And, you know, as everybody knows, you cry and you say, why me? You know, you do a little bit of blaming yourself, blaming God, blaming others. Uh, I was really stressed on the salon. Uh, so at the time, uh, I had actually uh, prayed about selling my salon. And I said, if I need to sell it, you send me someone to buy it. And in one week, I had three people trying to buy it. So I believe that if you can de-stress in any way, get that off of you. I felt like, and I did feel like that it was part of God's plan. I don't know what the next thing I'm going to be doing, uh, but I do know that he has a plan. And I believe that I blamed people. I blamed myself. Um, I was angry. I went through doubt. I did go through like, am I going to survive this? You know, am I going to see those grandbabies? Am I going to... Um, see my daughter married and, you know, grow old with my husband. So there was a lot of things that your mind um, has a lot of things that it brings forward at that time when you hear the word cancer. I don't believe I'll ever be the same. My sister has even said, you will never, ever be the same. You're a survivor, but you'll never be the same. Because cancer, the word cancer does change your life. Uh, for years, she would, every time she got a lump, any kind of, you know, it scares you because you're like, oh, is it back? Oh, is it back? So I believe that that is a normal, uh, a normal reaction because we all, you know, we want to live and um, there is only one that grants us that. So I believe that it changed my life forever. I believe that I am more appreciative of everything that I have. Each day that I wake up, I'm so thankful. I thank him for the sun and I can look around the stream that's rolling and there's just so many beautiful things that maybe I didn't take time. I was busy working and trying to make a living um, and God just decided to make me start living. <laughs> so um, I'm just, you know, I can't say I'm thankful for cancer because I was scared to death. And, um, but I will say the word cancer changes you forever.